stupidly epic. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to You Got 5 Minutes. Today's game is Wonder Boy and the Dragon's Trap. It's a remake of the original Wonder Boy and the Dragon's Trap on the Sega Master System back in the day. Uh, the I think it's Wonder Boy 3? Wonder Boy 3 maybe? I'm not sure, like, I'm not sure, I've never done any research on it. But uh, I'm pretty sure from like the things that I've seen in videos and that it was meant to be a remake of the third Wonder Boy on the Master System. Anyway guys, um, this is like... Essentially a from the ground remake in everything except the gameplay. The gameplay is 100% intact from the from the original game. They've essentially rescored the game, reanimated it, and uh, and redrawn everything to make it look totally beautiful and sound totally beautiful. Uh, but and 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 later on in the video, you'll see why it's like why the gameplay is left totally intact. It's like they've they've made it so that you're able to switch on the fly between the original game and the. The, the 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 you know the modern like visuals and all that and you can flick uh, flick between the the modern music and the the retro music as well. Uh, what a cool idea! <laughs> um, the 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 uh, the remakes of the Monkey Island games kind of done this as well, but I think this I think this is a better implementation of that that same system. Um, in the, in the, uh, the remakes of the Monkey Island games, you were able to go from the modern visuals back to the classic visuals and. You know, uh, and you know, back and forth like that, and vice versa. Um, but I've never actually played Wonder Boy 3 before, so like, uh, I've seen this on sale on the PSN, so I thought, you know, I'll just grab it, grab it, see what, see what it's like. This fight here is totally annoying because <laughs> this dragon <laughs> keeps on bopping you, pushing you away. It's like it doesn't do an awful lot of damage to you. Uh, and it's quite rare that it does actually damage you, but like, it just it just pushes you away. It's just a wee, wee, boom, push. And, <laughs> yeah, it's like, so, the setup to the game is you're just, you're just like gonna, you're good about this castle, you've got to fight a dragon. And so, total fight the dragon, it's a big mecha dragon. Um, and, uh, yeah, well, you, you, you'll, you'll, you'll see. It's like, the, the game's called The Dragon's Curse, eh, so... Or The Dragon's Trap, sorry. So... Yeah, you'll you'll get it in a second, once he's dead. <laughs> um, but yeah, look at, look at the visuals of this game, guys. This is like, absolutely top-tier animation. Top-tier sort of... Uh, Top tier sounds, top tier animation. It's so funny because uh, the gameplay itself, like if, if like later on you'll 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 see the original retro sort of visuals of the game. But uh, it, it's funny. It's funny to think that a, the the gameplay, the actual gameplay to this game, still holds up perfectly well. Like I don't know how many people would play this game. Uh, purely if they, like, you know, you know, purely for the the original aesthetic of the game, I think most people would want to play it with the, the modern visuals and modern audio. But it's just funny to see how the original gameplay is totally intact, absolutely and utterly, impeccably, like just re remade for this game. The gameplay is left intact, but the visuals are the only thing that's changed and. You're able to experience the original game from way back in the day, and the game plays just as good as it ever did because the gameplay is not changed at all. <laughs> it's so cool to see that. It's so cool to see the. Uh, <clears throat> it's so cool to see that the uh, the original game has like not lost its luster at all in terms of its gameplay. So uh, yeah, man. <laughs> so he's the dragon's total set his trap. He's totally a dragon now. He wondered why he's a dragon now. And uh, yeah, you're able to total run around as uh, as a dragon. 
But like, later on, like I've, I've not actually got that far into the game, I've, I've ju essentially just recorded the first 10 minutes of this game just to show you guys. Um, but later on in the game you'll, you'll be able to uh, turn into different creatures, like one of them's a lion and one of them's a mouse. I think I think there's another one that's like a bird or something like that. It's like, it gives you the, you know, runs the whole gamut of, uh, of creatures, like the lions, like the warrior, the dragons, like the magic thing, the mouse is like... You can crawl into spaces that you normally wouldn't be able to get into as a human or whatever, you know? And, uh, yeah, wow, what a cool... Look at the, look at how beautiful this game is. <laughs> it's so, so well animated. Wow, with a face like yours, I'd be looking for the antidote right now. <laughs> um, but just, like, look at the, look at the way everyone's drawn, guys. It's such a really, really cool looking game. Uh, I didn't care if you can breathe fire underwater, but I'm not going to complain. Uh, it's just his attack, I suppose. Um, so it was taking me a wee while to figure out, because because I, I, I was wondering what button it was like to flick between the old retro style stuff and the new, the modern stuff. So we'll get there, though. We'll get there. Um, I, I find out like it's actually the R3 button, like you click in the right analog stick to total change the audio. But for some reason it's R2 to change the visuals. I would have thought it would have been like the left analog stick to change the visuals, but um, yeah, I'm not complaining. It's like it's not a, it's not a gameplay issue at all. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it just like visually it just looked beautiful, guys. Like I like I, I can't I can't emphasize enough how gorgeous this game looks. And I mean, if you've not picked it up yet. Uh, you really should. <laughs> you 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 really should. Uh, you really should pick it up because like e even e there you go. Like I've, I've, I've you changed changed the audio to like the total retro stuff. But uh, yeah, if you've if you've not actually picked it up yet, uh, and if you and if and, and if you're kind of on the fence and you want to kind of wait for a sale, then fair enough. I mean, I mean like I'm not gonna I'm not gonna try and like twist your arm or anything like that. But like the visual upgrades and the audio upgrades. Uh, to this game, make this like you. You must own this game just to experience like the the original gameplay combined with like how beautiful and like this game sounds and looks. Because it's utterly, completely and utterly faithful to the the original the original game in terms of what it's trying to do. You know, like they 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 they've, they've went for a stylistic choice of like designing the levels based on the mood that they give out, rather than, you know, trying to make everything look all super ultra high definition detailed in that. They're like, well, well, what's the feeling of this level? You know, this is a kind of beachy kind of level, but if you like, if you flick to the, <clears throat> if you flick to the, uh, the original visuals, you know, but you still get that feeling, the same feeling of it, like it being like a, a beach or like a, like a sort of tropical island or whatever, you know? Um, but yeah, guys, man, like, I, I, I don't know what else to say, we've still got a few minutes left, but uh, yeah, highly, highly recommend it. Um, <laughs> it's funny as well, because like, I've had this downloaded on my on my hard drive for total ages, but I've just never gotten around to, to recording it until now, and uh, I feel stupid because, like, it's weird. Every time I do that, <laughs> every time I, I buy something and never play it, and then record it later on, like way later, like months later, uh, <laughs> I like I'm sla I'm I'm smacking my head because I'm I'm, I'm 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 like beating myself up over it because I'm like man like I could have been playing this ages ago and I didn't even realise how good it was you know so uh, yeah I hope the I hope the videos sort of given you like a wee bit of uh, even just like a quick wee look at the sort of the, the, the gameplay and like just yeah uh, it's just it just looks so good man. it just looks so cool. Um, Yeah, it's just I, 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 I don't know I don't know what else to say guys it's just like it's just really really cool and uh, I think the uh, I think what the the team have done uh, I think it's dot nu that's uh, that they're either the publisher or the, or the developer I can't remember exactly who it was but like uh, yeah they've, they've done it like whoever it was that done the, the sort of the animation and the the graphic style and the audio and all that they've, they've done an excellent excellent job so like you know 
high sort of high praise from me when it comes to like the, them them doing their, their their job in terms of like what they what they what they what they went set out to do is I think what they've achieved. So uh, yeah, extremely successful sort of from the ground up remake. There you go. See, there's a vision like. It's like a sort of jungle, jungle kind of set in there. Here's the, here's the original style again. But you can just, you can just do that on the fly. You just tap L2 and it just uh, like kind of flicks between it. Yeah, absolutely gorgeous. Um, <laughs> so cool. This is really, really, really well done. The bloody clouds. Get rid of the clouds. Oh, I must have had a potion. Yeah, I, th I think if you've got a potion in your inventory, if you get killed, then it's like an auto-use potion. No cos cosplay as a goblin. No questions asked. Ah, I'm totally short on the short on the money side. But yeah, uh, what what a cool look, look at the size of the arrows and the swords coming through the total buildings. <laughs> That's really cool. Never noticed that before. Uh, yeah, guys, like, wow, what a, what a cool, what a cool sort of remake, reboot sort of thing. Um, they should do that with a lot more games, like, I'd love to see other classic games like this retain their, their base gameplay and, uh, you know, just be totally reanimated and, like, re, like, you know, re-audioed and all that. But yeah guys, that was just a quick wee look at uh, Wonder Boy and the Dragon's Trap. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you liked it, give us a like and subscribe and all that crap. Thanks very much guys. Bye! I'd like to uh, apologise for, uh, you know, uh, not sounding as quite as uh, quite as good as, uh, as, as, as I normally sound because uh, this time uh, uh, I had my microphone a bit further away from my face this time. So, uh, um, uh, sorry about that. Sorry, sorry, sorry.